Now that you've made an investment in your red back boots, you're gonna to wanna to make them last as long as possible and make them look as good as they can. Out of the box, they're good to go. The leathers are full of oil and protected. After a while, the boot will start to look a little more rugged. Uh, the leather will have faded a little bit and you can see that the leather is starting to dry out. So that's your cue to take four easy steps to, to make your boots look as good as they can and give them a little TLC. And the first thing to do is just to wipe the boot down with a damp rag remove all the dust and the dirt from the creases, especially this flex point right here. The, the dust and the dirt down inside that crease there just acts like sandpaper and, and, and will erode away at the, the leather. So wipe the boot down, get it as, as clean as possible. In Canada, we've got three feet of salty snow in the winter time. You get that white salt stain on the side of the boot. You can use a damp rag with a little bit of vinegar on it and water, and that will remove the, the salt from the side of the boot. You don't want salt on the side of the boot because it's, it's, it can damage the leather also. So just with a bit of water and vinegar on a damp rag, wipe it down, remove it from the side of the boot. Once the boot has been wiped down, let it dry at room temperature. Do not put it next to a wood stove or a, uh, a furnace, that kind of thing. Let it dry at room temperature. You can put in one of these uh, shoe trees, uh, which are made of cedar, and um, they'll just go down inside the boot and help to dry it, or you can just stuff it with some newspaper and help to keep the shape of the boot. Once the boot is dry, we're gonna use some of our Redback Boot Rejuvenator, which is a combination of oil and wax, and it just helps to hydrate the boot. So just a little bit on the fingertips, and working it into the leather really helps to hydrate the boot and make it uh, supple again. And uh, just work that in with the heat of the hands and that's gonna make your red back boots look as good as possible for as long as they can. The last thing you'll wanna do is to just, if you can repeat that process every couple of months, wipe the boot down, let it dry room temperature, hydrate the boot with some of our red back boot rejuvenator and your boots will be good for a long time. So a lot of you have been asking if we can use the Redback Boot Rejuvenator on the Tussock Nubuck boot. You can. If you want to keep this light color material here, then I would suggest a, a suede protector or something. But if you use the Redback Boot Rejuvenator, I'll just show you uh, how, how it does go a lot darker on the boot. We'll just work a bit of this into the front of the boot here. You can see how much darker it does get on the side of the boot. Some customers really like this. It, it gives it a really nice kind of a rustic, rugged kind of look to the boot. And uh, I'll just show you a boot that I did about three months ago. That's this color here. And you can see the difference between the two boots there. So that was done about three months ago using the Redback Boot Rejuvenator. Gives it a really nice, as I said, rustic, rugged look to it.